All right, here's the screen. So I really like the screens based upon how they're playing those backside three techniques. If they're folding those three techniques, folding those in, something where they will lose something backside, I really like the screen off the of counter. So this is the gun GY counter screen to the tight end. So basically, we're, we're, we, we did something where it looks like counter. We're pulling the guard. They're heavy pull read with this backside linebacker. So what we want to do is we want to give them all the sauce they want, and we want to be able to come off backside and attack that void vacancy where they left from. So we're giving them everything they want. We're going to give them y'all one the double team because everything for us is whenever we run a screen or a perimeter play, the linebackers become priority over the D-line. We really don't have to block the D-line anymore. So the swimming and all that kind of stuff, y'all going to have it. It's all y'all. You know, we don't, we're not, we don't really care much. What we want to do is we want to leverage this backside linebacker and we want to be able to take away that space right there from them overplaying the counter look. So if they say, hey, they're screaming counter, 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 back and tight end weak. Got to have things off of it that you can do. So not only will we go with the with the counter screen with the, to the tight end, we also will go to the back on it. Mm -hmm. Now, even more, we said, well, coach, y'all only got one puller. Okay, cool. Now we give you two pullers. So we got guard, tackle, counter. We got GY counter with an attached tight end weak going back to the attached tight end. So same thing of having that balance of things off of the gap schemes to bat some relief for guys. So we give them GY counter from the gun, tight end screen. 